Brand. I'm head of art at MNC Saatchi, uh, Middle East and North Africa. Um, I've been in Lebanon for three years. I'll talk a little bit about the, you know, how we got to the idea of, of you know, doing this, this happening in the airport. Um, uh, together, you know, collaborating, you know, with, with my team here, um, in the summer uh, of last year, we came up with this platform uh, for, for Beirut Duty Free, which was uh, Take Back More. And we created some, uh, you know, a summer campaign um, that, that basically kind of sort of reminded people of, of the kind of sort of good things, you know, in Lebanon. You know, digital is a, a very, very big part of, of the future. You know, it's the, the future, really, of, of our industry. So it's, you know, you get an instant response from your, from your customers. We, we purposely, the strategy, was it for it, for it to be a viral campaign? Um, okay. It's me, Jimmy Razel. Uh, I'm head of digital by MNC Sachi. دوري نسي كل شيء ديجيتال وكل شيء اونلاين للادفرتايزمنت ولا الكوميونيكيشن بال بالشركة يعني الهدف انه نخلق انجيجمنت مع العالم يعني نخلي العالم يكونوا جزء من الدعاية عم يتفاعلوا معه هو الديجيتال يلي بيميزه يعني كل شيء على على الانترنت بمعنى الانترنت يلي بيميزه هو التفاعل مع العالم كيف نخلي العالم يحبوا الدعاية يتفاعلوا معه ويشاركوا أصحابهم على على الإنترنت وهذا الشيء اللي بنقدر ناخده بال بال بالإنترنت ما بنقدر ناخده على على التي في أو على الراديو أو على البيلبورد ما عم نقول إنه ديجيتال أقوى أو أهم من البيلبورد أو هذا أو تراديشنال ميديا بس بمعنى بمطارح ديجيتال هي البلاتفورم المناسب من مطارح تاني بتكون سبورت لنا بهال إكسرسايز هذا اللي كان عنا Digital was the platform. يعني هو كان ال platform الأساسي يلي فيها ينطلق من منه كل شيء. ونعرف نحن إنه بلبنان في عنا كتير internet penetration عم تتحسن. يعني بلبنان تقريبا ربع العالم موجودين على الانترنت. واحد على أربعة من 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 السكان هو على الانترنت. The thinking behind it, okay, it basically started, you know, in a in a room like this here. You know, we sat around the table, we brainstormed. And we started to think that um, the airport and the duty free is, you know, the first and the last place you visit when you come to Lebanon. Okay, um, and it's you know, uh, it's a nice space. You know, it's it's I'm sure I'm sure, you know, that the people that are not familiar with 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 Lebanon and, and haven't been here and haven't travelled here that you know. Um, I'm sure they still think that maybe it's not, you know, contemporary or, or modern. And we started to think about an idea that would capture the, the spirit and the tradition, you know, of Lebanon. You know, so, so it, was a, it was a combination of things. It, we wanted some heritage, you know, some, some Lebanese heritage. And we wanted uh, some contemporary, you know, Activity, you know, within that. Uh, Odile, you know, who's our creative director, she, she sort of, we were sitting in this room and she said, How about a Debke flash mob in the airport? Uh, and, it, you know, the minute she said it, it was like, What, what a fantastic idea. It kind of sort of, it made everyone kind of have goosebumps and think, Wow, well, if we could make that happen, if we could. Get the client to, to, to agree to that and you know put it together and, and make it happen for real. Um, you know what a fantastic thing that would be. Flash mob, and customized لنا يعني كانت دبكة كانت لبنانية كانت بمطار بلبنان قلنا أخذنا أيديا متداولة بين العالم فكرة منا غريبة عن العالم بس عملناها 
بتدق باللبناني وبتحس معه. We knew it would go viral. We knew people would upload it, and we knew that maybe people would watch it. We had no idea that it would go so fast, you know, and that was brilliant. و actually تقريبا تسعين أو خمسة وتسعين بالمية من العالم يلي موجودين على الإنترنت هن موجودين على فيسبوك. So و بد ضخامة فيسبوك وأهمية فيسبوك هو إنه بتخلي المسج توصل للعالم. So تخيلوا الكومبينيشن بين فيديو على يوتيوب على أكبر فيديو بلاتفورم مع بالتعاون مع فيسبوك تويتر والسوشيال ميديا الخبرية بتاخد ثواني بتكون وصلت ل مئات والوف ومئات الالوف من الاشخاص والشيء اللي عم نشوفه انه بظرف خمس ست ايام اللي هن تقريبا بقل من جمعه صار في اكثر من نص مليون فيو على الفيديو. The process was obviously very rigorous, you know, we had to get a lot of approval for the crew and the people and everyone to come into the airport. Um, you know, essentially how it, how it came together was that we, um, we worked together with a production company, okay, and, and we found a director, uh, Amin, who's, who's a great guy, um, and with the production company Zoe, we, we basically um, worked together as a team. You know, they, they found a, a Deb K dance troupe, and we started to sort of create, uh, you know, a, a map of what would happen in the airport. Okay, and the whole idea was to was to do it for real. I mean, we had four people kind of walking around with big cameras. Yeah. You know, we wanted to capture what happened, different angles to, to capture the the, the, the the dance itself, um, and you know the reactions of people, the dance troupe, and the you know the way you know what happened. You know, where the guy starts to sort of sing, um, and then people start to dance the Deb K, and and it all kind of you know ends up. You know, meeting in the middle. You know, we we rehearsed that. You know, that was that was rehearsed, and um, you know, and but but what we what we we didn't tell anyone we were going to do it. I mean, we didn't tell any passengers. There was no kind of, you know, hey, you know, what we're filming in the airport. We did it for real, and we got real reactions to it. So this was a collaboration between us, the director, and 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 the, and the music people, which is very very important. The music was was essential, and you know essential in that we wanted to bring these two worlds together, traditional and contemporary, and, and that's why the you know in the in the dance itself we included not just hip -hop traditional Deb K but hip hop you know kind of moves. Really joyful thing, and, and people did join in. There was surprise. Uh, there was um, very quickly people people started to smile and clap and cheer. Some people could dance the Deb K. Uh, some people didn't. Uh, you'll see in the final cut that I, I even had a, a, a go at, at one point. <laughs> it just got huge, huge, huge response. <laughs> 